these are the five things that I wasted my time on in my 20s. Hey guys, just turned 30 years old and I'm in my reflective period here. So I've been thinking about some things that if I could go back in time, I would do completely different. So I'm gonna give you the five things that I wish I could do differently if I had a chance. Number one, no serious relationship. Um, 30 now and I feel like all I see around is people in serious relationships. Everyone on social media posting couple photos, everyone getting engaged. I never had a serious relationship in my 20s and now I feel like I'm playing catch up here. Uh, so I was just single, 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 and now I'm 30 and it's like, uh-oh, I feel like I don't have any experience now. So if I could go back in time, I would try and commit to a girl more than I have in my past. One thing on the relationship thing, guys, one of the quotes I think about all the time is if you've ever seen a Bronx tale where he says you get three great women in life, I think about that all the time. And I really hope I still have a great one out there. I'm gonna tell you something right now. You're only allowed three great women in your lifetime. They come along like the great fighters once every 10 years. Number two, uh, no stability, guys. Uh, I moved four times in my 20s, and while, yeah, it was great experience moving and meeting new people, I loved that, uh, but when you do move four times, it's you're not stable. Uh, you're constantly changing jobs, changing social groups, changing environment, and when I did that, it's not that I fully regret it, but at the same time, um, now I don't have like a, a like a strong social group in one city. Uh, they're kind of all over the place. My best friends around the world uh, are around the world. They're not all in New York City. And it's not like I love New York City either. So at some point, I'm going to move out of there. So another move's coming. So yeah, I kind of regret that in my 20s that uh, I wish I was a little more stable at one location. Number three. I did too much. Uh, I did too much, guys. I really wish if I stuck with one thing over my 20s or I put more effort into it, um, I'd be at a much better place today. Um, like, give you an example. I was uh, one of the early writers for Bleacher Report where I was writing for the Miami Dolphins. And this was when Bleacher Report was on the way up. And I stopped. I gave gave it up. But I had fifty to 100,000 views over my time of writing, I don't even remember how many articles, like 20 articles or something like that. Yeah, if I, if I stuck with Bleacher Report, um, could have been a completely different career path for me. I could have been a sports writer. Um, so that's a little bit of regret. I tried opening a clothing brand online. I'm trying YouTube now. I'm trying real estate investing. I've tried a bunch of different jobs. I've never stayed at a job longer than two years before. So if I could go back to my 20s, I would try and be a little bit more stable with some of my decisions. Try and you know see things through a little bit more and giving more effort because you get more experience that way. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. If you guys are enjoying the video so far, make sure you go ahead, like, comment, and subscribe if you've gotten some good advice from me. If not, keep watching. I promise I'm gonna help you out. All right, let's keep going. Number four, um, make sure you guys stretch and take care of your body. Uh, you know how older people are always making fun of like people in their teens or in their 20s and they're saying, oh, to be young again, I wish I could be your age and go do what you could do. Um, there's a reason for that. When you get older, your body starts breaking down. You don't know when it's gonna happen, but it hits at some point. I'm 30 now, and a couple years ago, I properly injured my back. I uh, did it uh, in the gym, and I had it was so bad, I had to go to a chiropractor to get it sorted out and get it fixed. So now when I'm in the gym, I'm constantly stretching my back after every workout to make sure I don't go through a back injury again. So if you're in your 20s, do yourself a favor, make sure you stretch after your workout, stretch before, and get some massages here or there. You need them, take care of your body. Number five, uh, bad investing. And this is something I'm 30 years old and I feel like I wanna get better financially. So I'm looking a lot into financial research and where should I be investing and how much should I be putting into my 401k. And I really, really wish I started 10 years ago at 20 years old. If I was just putting $100 away into an index fund, or if I bought an apartment in Boston when I first moved there out of college, um, I, that apartment would be so, worth so much more today and it would just be money invested in something. So if I could take it all back, I would start investing much earlier. So if you're in your 20s and you want to get going with investing, shoot me a DM. I'm happy to tell you some advice in terms of what I've learned and what I'm doing now in terms of investments across my portfolio. Let's let the train pass. <laughs> I can't get through my monologue here. This train keeps going by. <laughs> 